some of the clarifications for when USCIS is potentially waiving interviews? Yes, so we had done a YouTube video about this and I realized that there was some confusion and I wanna make it a little bit more clear. So I'm glad we're starting there. But basically, you know, there are multiple types of interviews that people can go through in an immigration process. Some of them happen at USCIS offices inside the United States and other interviews actually happen at the US embassies um, in foreign countries. So one thing we wanted to clarify is that currently the only um, interviews that we are in some cases seeing waived are marriage or employment based green card interviews at USC USCIS offices inside the United States. So that's important. I know a lot of people were wondering, are the embassy interviews going to be waived or you know, non-immigrant visa interviews going to be waived? And, and there's really, in my entire career, I've never seen those types of interviews be waived. Um, previously, we were seeing with the, you know, in previous years, USCIS has sometimes waived some family-based um, green card interviews and some employment-based green card interviews. Uh, but they had stopped doing that under a request by the Trump administration to interview every single person that they legally could, contributing to some of their financial difficulties, I believe, um, because they're just seeing people they don't even really need to see. Um, do you think that that kind of clarifies the, the, the main confusions we were seeing with people, uh, Coley? Yeah, I think most of the confusions um, that I had seen were people wondering if the embassies were also waiving interviews. Um, so it sounds like the embassies are not doing that at all. If you're having your interview outside of the United States, even if that has been rescheduled, it will not be waived. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. currently, to my knowledge, there's that's not happening and there's no legal process for that. I think one of the things that, you know, a lot of people upon hearing the news, okay, some interviews are being waived. First, people were obviously trying to figure out, could my interview be waived? But I think it's important to also realize that, you know, Yes, it would be great if your interview is waived. We hope that lots of people have waived interviews that have USCIS interviews, but it's actually going to be helpful to all applicants, the fact that they started waiving some interviews, um, because if you have anything that's heading through USCIS, whether that's a petition or, or a naturalization case, or maybe you have a marriage-based case at USCIS, but you're, you still are going to be interviewed, the fewer people they're interviewing, the faster they get through that backlog and that huge queue of people and, and, and lower those processing times. So that's why we really see it as good news for everyone, whether you, indi you know, individually get waived or not. All right. Thanks for that clarification.